Fuel prices increased by 8 toya as of yesterday. The Independent Consumer and Competition Commission said it was increased because of an increase in crude oil prices in world market, an increase in the domestic sea and road freight, and the continued depreciation of the Kina value in recent months. The only two cost components of the retail fuel price that are set by the Commission are quarterly sea and road freight rates and annual retail and wholesale tariffs for the petroleum products. The changes in, in these factors only account for about 15% of the total changes in the retail prices. Commissioner Manoka said the public should not be concerned about an increase in public transport fares, which is a likely fallout effect. However, the fuel increase will take a toll on those who provide the service. Concerns were raised today by public transport providers who said it was hard enough finding customers, let alone facing increased fuel prices. At least we place a work now. Place like more coins and place put in one side, drain in one side of fuel now. Fuel that's all as a mem like sim so. We place it time straight now. We place one at least put all put in some block go down. Let us slow them. At least all put it go down and right now I'm going up so. We place it time straight now around here so. While global economics of demand and supply have a major impact on petroleum prices, social instability in oil-producing countries determine fuel price as well. ICCC's influence on fuel price lies in retail and wholesale tariffs that cause a variation in fuel prices from province to province. Dr. Manoka said it is possible for Papua New Guinea to have lower fuel prices if fuel supply was consistent. Salome Vincent, National MTV News.